Send to camp. Do 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 do. -do. Send to camp. All right. Okay. Put these back in that. And put these into the camp box. All right. What now? Okay. What am I to do? Uh. Let's see. He needs mage armor. Okay, and you need symbiotic entity. No one stopped me yet. And the dog has something. Did you murder the, the guy last time? And after he's already red dragon runner. Bag he holds in his mouth. I did. Fu no, I talked my way through that patrol. I'm pretty sure he jumped on the dragon and flew away after I had Lazel talk to them. I certainly didn't fight the dragon. Hey. All I know is I thought of you when I saw it. Sorry about what happened to your master. Master? Friend. I stayed with him until... until I knew he was gone. I'll never forget him. But I'm glad to have met you. Yes, I am good. Pet. Hmm. Orpheus, Prince of the Comic, Part 1, Betrayal. I think I already read all this. Yeah, we read that. Alright, so... And the worst. Quanith Psionic Detector. Okay... Okay. We'll leave camp. Mm, oh, wait, I needed to go to the Underdark. That's where I was trying to go when uh, it suddenly warped me here. Wait, what? A player can't currently travel. Father, can I go? Why? All right, leave camp then. <sighs> yeah, I'm pretty sure in both my playthroughs, like one, I talked to the patrol. Uh, Adlai Zell talked to them, but then he still had them attack me and then he left. The second playthrough, I just uh, just went in and was like, you know, hi, what's up? And then he ordered them to attack me and he left with less conversation. But yeah, didn't see this guy last time. I love your hair, it's awesome. Uh, Kvetalopi, I just saw your message. I don't know if you mean Dennis's hair or my hair, but I'll take it either way. <laughs> Let's see, add that to worse. Okay, where are we? Underdark still in Alphas. Okay, so we want to go Underdark Beach. Get to the new area. Waste of step. I'm on a boat. Um, we need to make more zombies. Shattered Dwerger. Can you reanimate Shattered Dwergers? Target cannot be reanimated. No, too gooey. Executed Deep Gnome. What about that? Please, Mr. Yes, that does work. Okay. So let's throw this guy on the ground. There we go. The boys are back. Alright, tap quick save. Up on the boat. A vessel wobbles on the lake's murky waters. Sail into the darkness. Did you kill the Inquisitor of the Crash? In both games, yeah. But it didn't happen last time, it did happen this time. Valentine Gilbert Sue's playing this as well. Uh, you might team up. Oh, I'm just playing single player. I find it to be very, very slow when I'm playing with other people. Raft. 
Where's Gek? Who are you? Push him into the water? <laughs> Alright, I'm much better at, in at uh, intimidation than athletics, but I have to try. Shove him into the water. Elixir of Hill Giant Strength. Plus five. Plus five. Pictures of Spider Man! First try. Asterian approves. <laughs> oh, a naval battle. What? Uh, okay. Hmm. can't reach. You just had enough movement a second ago. What? Did you see that? He like coiled up his legs and then said no. Bro, I'm so, I'm so upset. He wasted his whole turn because of that. Not the first time we've had the little predictive thing be completely wrong. Watch, now I'm going to fail the dice roll. I'm just trying to restart the battle so that Gale can have his turn back. That's it. Will made Repelling Blast made this fight hilariously short. Yeah, I was trying to Thunder Wave them in the water. Repelling Blast is the same thing. Where's Gek? Who are you? Oh, hey, imagine that. <sighs> if I get past the dice roll, I guess I have to quick save again in case Gale loses his turn. Yo, you get tons of those elixirs. I, I had gotten past it without using the elixir, though. The problem isn't the elixir. The problem is that the uh, the thing told me I, I could do the jump, and then it didn't, and used up his whole Where's turn anyway. Gek? Who are you? Holy crap! <laughs> it's just like we're having more and more just issues compound upon the fact that that thing bugged out. Hmm. Where's Gek? Who are you? <laughs> All right, so we used an inspiration. Still worse than before. Gale doesn't get to go first this time. And we get critical before we get a turn this time, so still way worse than last time. Diligence and care. I'm just hoping they don't push Gale in the water. Yeah. 
mind mastery? Oh god, is that like mind control? What is that? Forced to make a weapon attack against one of its allies by a Dwerger mind master. Wait, what? This oh, so because Gale's mind control, the skeletons are too. But I can just manually tell them to shoot their friend, and it's still fine. Jump out of the fire. Alright, so he's concentrating. Concentration broken. Another fight. Let's go. I don't think he can make the jump over there. Gust of wind. Woo! <laughs> We're not getting a lot of loot from this one, but that's okay, I'm having fun. Critical miss. So I cl probably click on the rudder to continue. Man, both of Asterion's birds died. Craft is ready to sail. Continue your journey across the lake. Last time I just talked my way through that and that guy escorted us to the next area. we got here? Dead hoon walking, seems like. Got any reason I shouldn't sever your head and toss it to the Rothe? Another belligerent dwarf? This is getting tiresome. <laughs> I'll be severing yours if it's all the same. We'll see about... You feel the slightest of stirrings in your head. The Dwergar is not infected, yet your minds resonate. Oh, I'll be. You're one of them cult freaks. Felt the tingle. In that case, let's talk business. Your twat's old friend Nair caused a rock to trapped tighter than a hornet's arse. Couple of known slaves stuck with him, too. Little bastards. You absolute shaggers owe us a crap load of coin. You want through? Make a donation. <laughs> I'll take your head before you take my gold. Unclog your hole. Just shitting around. <laughs> Testing the water is more like it. That twat soul ain't settled up soon. There'll be hell to pay for the lot of you cult buggers. All the charm and wit you'd expect from a slaver. Even a slaver of gnomes. Asterion, I'm a gnome. Watch your mouth. Well, hello. Alright. Resummon the Dire Raven. 
and resummon the familiar raven. And do I do a short rest? I don't know if I want to do a short rest. Who designed? Now nah, we'll just quick save right there. Mm, battered note. Can I read that without starting something? Hey, prickheads. Slave grub in the right barrel, Rothschild in the left. Next of you shites, I see flubbing it, is getting a hot poker up the R sideways. Thread. Sideways? Ooh. Grubby map. On one side of the page, a hand-drawn map depicts a northern grotto bordering the Ebon Lake. An attacker's account marks the other. One of the drungling shrooms sensed us and split. Chunky one, too. Months worth of soap at least. Soup at least. The rest were too busy droning to put up a fuss. Oh, that was the one that made it to the other mushroom place. Uh, Nier pays us, and I'm bolting for Mantral Dareth. Thren's orders be damned. They got eel steak, mineral mead, and top land food of all sort. Can't, uh, clan can't live on fungus alone. You know what I'm realizing? I have not seen anything related to the um, Dark Urge in a very long time. Oh, sorry. What's a fort like this doing in the underdark? No mm, one of those is a merchant. Stonemason Kith. <laughs> now Kith. How peculiar. Smooth face. Cobbled edges. They're a sign. They must be. A sun dweller in these parts. Look here, my topside friend. I need fresh eyes, and I doubt I'll find fresher. A friendly welcome! A rarity in the Enderdark. As rare as a smile in Shindlerin, you might say. But I've no skill for slaving. I prefer chisel to cane. But these learned eyes reach their limits, and so I must humbly request yours. What are you doing exactly? Peering into cracks and crevices in hope to find history's morsels. I have come up regrettably short. I hope you might see truths where I cannot. What should I be looking at? The rock, the rubble, all of it, if I may be so bold. Take a look. Tell me what you see. And be thorough. Hmm. F5. Perception. Survey the area for unseen curiosities. Several glassy stones stand out in the debris. Their borders are coated with tiny yellow crystals. The hottest of flames smoothed the stone and left sulfuric crystals behind. The fires of the hells have touched Grimforge. Investigation. Boulders and stone bricks of various sizes clutter the corridor. Many split cleanly in two. Yet some walls remain fully intact. No quake brought these rocks down. They were smashed through in an instant. Something big charged through here. Something very big. What do you think? F5. History. Assess the statue for technique and composition. The statue's meandering curves and golden edges stand out against the weathered masonry behind it. Two styles, two eras. The statue was carved from newer stone and erected by latecomers to this ancient fortress. Anything standing out? I am ready to report my observations. Incredible. An entire history risen from dirt and debris. Picture it. An ancient city hewn from the stone by disciples of Shah, later abandoned. Untold centuries later, a new tribe revives it. Fresh walls, fresh sculptures, 
Until a great hell beast charges through, toppling the walls and crushing the people. Oh, that explains the infernal plate I found. Perhaps you might have use of it. Like the ones that Carlock would use? But my work has only begun. There is more still to find. I must get to it. I would like to trade. Well, let's see what you've got. Mm -hmm. Do I need any of that? Okay. That's all then. Yeah, since Carlock's not on the team, since we're the bad guys, uh, I don't know if I have any use for the Infernal Plates, but I'm hanging on to them for now. Uh, can I talk to these animals? Tired. Sleep. Rest, little one. But do not take long. I feel his shadow. I heard his name whispered. The rock shivers from the sound. The Ketherick Thorn. The name means little to you, yet your heart pulses to its rhythm. Thorn. Thorn. You fear this Ketherick Thorn. Who is he? Mm. Mighty elf, cloaked in darkness. Ten masters ago. And ten more. But I remember. There was the work. And the blood. There was the Thorm's army. There was the hell. Dude, how old is this raw? That broke them. The Ketherick Thorm's ten masters name ago. faded into stone. Until the near came. Oh, perfect. How <laughs> impressive memory. How old are you exactly? I outlived my mother and her mother's mother and many mothers beyond. Blessed to see many live. Cursed to see many die. What kind of hell beast destroyed the army? I saw tusks and flesh. Smelled Fire and eggs. Egg smell of sulfur. It came with the mask men, crashing and smashing. Chad, I have smelled sulfur. It is awful. That crap smells nasty. That was a long time ago. What does Nair have to do with Ketherick? I know not, so I say not. Yet I hear his name again, said by the shadows. Okay. Deep breath. Hmm? Oh, are those two still talking? Sul sulfur is actually odorless, what people smell is hydrogen sulfide. Well, fine. Hydrogen sulfide smells nasty. <laughs> How about that? Damage Dark Justiciar Armor. Potion of Invis. Dark Justiciar Mail. Uh, Dark Justiciar's Journal. Cycle 40. I know it's forbidden to enter the Inquisitor's Chambers, but I could not help myself. Has Master Catherick not commanded us to use every possible tool to Beshar's rivals? Besides, if Cybill meant to keep the amulet a secret, she would have uh, hidden it better. Cycle 40 and 2. The amulet has given me a power, an energy, heretofore unknown to me. I've never known such might and such cheer. I could barely keep myself from smiling, much to the other chagrin. <laughs> Cycle 40 and 5. It is done, thank the Dark Lady. Sibyl ripped the amulet from my throat and cast it into the lava, having found me racked by laughter. The madness is lifted, but I do not know yet know my penance. Sibyl is not yet uh, known to take pity on thieves. Uh, okay... 
As you look at the skeletons, you realize they are all clad in the same dark armor. Dark Justicia uniforms. These were Shah worshippers. The same as me. Hmm. Aminus, let's not linger. Agreed. Let's go. We have places to be. The other options were all basically seemed to insult her religion, so I didn't really want to do that. Dark Justice, your helm, what was your wish? Uh, I want to see something. Not. Wait, is this? Oh yeah, target can't be reanimated. Okay. No point in stalking that corpse. Wonder if the gods are watching me. I saw you scuttling over Europe. Grab a cane and whip the beasts into shape. That rubble needs clearing. And my patience is hanging on by an arse whisker. It almost sounds like you're asking for help if I ignore your tone. And it sounds like your arse wants for a lashing. The way you talk out of it. Something <laughs> spoots the dumb shits. So stop your join and get to work in. Well, my guy is evil, chat. Oh, I know these creatures well. You should give them another lash. You got your orders. I'm not taking one more whack. Just as well, perhaps. Beat anything for long enough, and it'll snap. You aren't meant to like this NPC, Mark. Well, it's an evil playthrough. Nagobi, thank you for the prime sub. Welcome, I appreciate that. Please, are you so feeble? You can't deliver a single lash. Shit. You calling me weak, Jarg? <laughs> Crack! You knew I'd rile them up. I'll split you from head to hole for this. Bloody Rose, they have lost it. Put him down! <laughs> it started a fight. Uh. Hmm. Don't get too close. Not far enough. Sparta time? I'll see what I can do. Dennis doesn't go for a while yet. I don't remember this interaction at all. I think I missed it last time. God. More. Hunter's mark. That's fine. I'll backlash it though. Critical hit. 